Despite a grim outlook and dire predictions, America's military branches all reached their recruiting goals in fiscal year 2024. At the end of September, the services enlisted just shy of 225,000 new recruits. That's just over 25,000 more than last year. Mike Gooding has details. The Department of Defense military branches all met their recruiting goals in this past fiscal year. That includes the Navy, which had failed to hit its target for the prior two years. In fact, the Navy exceeded its FY24 goals, contracting nearly 41,000 new recruits by the end of the fiscal year, marking its most significant recruiting achievement in 20 years. This was no small feat. And I want to take a moment to recognize the frontline Navy recruiters who worked tirelessly to meet our goals. They did an outstanding job navigating a highly competitive recruiting market. Having struggled to meet their recruiting goals for the past two years due to the COVID-19 pandemic, market competition, and a shrinking pool of people willing or able to serve, this year the Army, Air Force, and Marine Corps also met their goals. We know we are, we are not out of the woods yet, but we remain steadfast to mission success this year and beyond. In the end, deterring or winning future conflicts in a time of consequence starts right here at home by winning in, in the competition space for talent. Marine recruiters will continue to meet the expectations of our nation by holding true to our warrior's ethos and our core values of honor, courage, and commitment. Mike Gooding, 13 News Now. The Coast Guard, which falls under the Department of Homeland Security, also met all of its recruiting goals for the first time in six years.